<laughs> Star <laughs> hour. It's Honey and Chili King back for another food review. Okay, so we ventured over to a place we I think we've only done one review for them. Uh, Hardee's. Yeah. yeah, we went to Hardee's today. I think we've only been there once for this television YouTube show. And today we were going to do just one item from there, but we realized they have three new items, so we're just going to do them all. Yeah, boy. So, so we went to Hardee's. Look at that pretty star. And we, uh, we got... Let me get the receipt out, because I'm not going to remember the names of the products. One thing we did get was, what do we get, Hudson? The bacon cheddar fries. We got bacon cheddar fries, which I'm excited about. Then we got a mushroom Swiss melt and a bacon cheddar melt. That's going to be excellent. So we're going to we're gonna eat the fries first. They've already been sitting a little bit. I hope they're not soggy and cold. I don't yeah, think they... Up. Yeah, open them up. I don't think they will be because they cooked them, uh, they cooked they them fresh. They just cooked them. Yeah, they cooked them fresh. Okay, <laughs> so that's kind of uninspiring. That's kind of janky. <laughs> so it didn't, the picture was impressive. Uh, well, every picture for food is impressive. Maybe they'll be good. They were $2.49. Uh, Hardy's has good French fries, I will say. I like I, it. I can't, or I've only had them so many times. You get that box when you yeah, go. No, does that not have fries? It does, but like we don't eat Hardy's much. No, we don't eat Hardy's a ton, but let me just tell you, we eat, we eat I like their fries. So anyway, let's see what we get with these bacon cheddar fries. So, um, again, they don't look... Too inspired. <laughs> too Oh. oh my gosh, that's a lot. So look, so, so you got, you got your, ooh, look, they're hot. So you got your cheese, you got your fries, you got your bacon bits or crumbled bacon or whatever it is. Uh, it smells good. All right, you ready? They're steamy. Cheers. Mmm, that's pretty good. <gasps> okay. That's their breakfast bacon. I'm familiar with that taste. That's pretty good. That's pretty okay. <laughs> pretty okay. Pretty solid. I feel like two forty nine is too expensive. But the taste is fine. This is really weird to me, but or weird to probably y'all. But if this was like, if this was on, if they had a one dollar menu, this would be a perfect item on a one dollar menu. Mm -hmm. cool. How about a two dollar menu? Like McDonald's. All right. Again, not bad, not great. Probably a little overpriced. All right, get us a knife. So, so we're gonna cut these in half. Here, yeah, uh, just something sharp. <laughs> so okay. this is the mushroom Swiss melt. That's something sharp. <laughs> yeah, that'll work. This is the mushroom Swiss melt. Look, it's got its own little sleeve. Look at that, honey. Whoa. So this is not a huge burger by any means. These are, I think these are three, they're $3. Did uh, you open up that one? No. This is kind of weird video. Dude, that knife did not do good on that bun. No. All right, get you half a burger. So this is a mushroom Swiss melt. I, I, look, yeah, look, I like mushrooms on anything, basically. Uh, I like Swiss cheese. It looks like that's all it's on it. Swiss cheese, a burger, and mushrooms. That's what uh, that looks like. Okay, so it's very simple. Yep. All right, you see that patty? Yep. Patties. All right, you ready to eat it? Cheers. Hmm. Every mushroom, mushroom and Swiss burger I eat, I feel like it needs like a sauce to go with it. It's got some kind of sauce in with the mushrooms. It's almost kind of like a little gravy. Um, it's not bad. I don't think it's worth three dollars either. No. That's a dollar ninety nine burger. I mean, it's a fun. It's okay. Mm, it tastes pretty good. All right. I'm gonna try this other one. I'm gonna go back and finish mine. I just wanna 
So it's got a little sleeve too. This is the. I love the sleeves. This is the bacon cheddar melt. I love bacon on a cheeseburger. So this so also is smallish. That one did get on the bun. But I will say this about Hardee's. Hardee's, the meat Hardee's uses is good. Uh, their beef. Whew. Look at that. Look at that. And their bacon's good. Their bacon seems to be 100% real. So this is the bacon cheddar melt. It was also $3 at the local Hardee's. Cheers. So that doesn't appear to have mustard or ketchup salty. or anything on it. Mm-hmm. That is salty. I don't love that. I think the mushroom Swiss is better. This hair is hitting out of control. Had some up. It's getting to be like some flock of seagull stuff. I would probably never get that again. I don't like the bacon. Their bacon's not great. No, I think the bacon's fine. It's just salty. And then when you combine it with that cheese and the beef. It looks so good from a visual though. I think it's dry. It needs mustard and ketchup and pickles or something. Yeah, it's real salty. But that's the bacon. Mmm. I don't know about that. That's disappointing. All right, Hudson. Hardee's claims to be the pioneers of the great American burger. What do you think? Here's what I think. While wow, you're chewing that up. I think there's way better burgers at Hardee's. I don't know what the number one burger is on the on the combo list, but that's what I usually get, and it is excellent. The thick burger. It's a yeah, it's some kind of okay. I don't know third pound, quarter pound thick burger. I think it's a third pound. It's really good. It's just like a standard cheeseburger. <clears throat> I need a flashback on what this tastes like because I just ate I like I like it way better than this. All right, well, let's grade these things. So let's start with the bacon cheddar fries for two dollars and forty nine cents at your local. Hardy's. It's a solid four and a four point one. Hmm. For the bacon cheddar fries. The cheese is really good. Um I'm okay with the taste. I think they're a little expensive. I'm gonna go with a three point seven five on that. If they were two dollars, they would be at least a four, if not better. Uh, I think scary. it's kind of scary watching videos and you're like pointing the fork at the, <laughs> the camera. And like I said, I wouldn't turn these down. I just think they're a little overpriced. How about that? Yeah. All right. What would you give? The mushroom Swiss melt, which is three dollars at your local Hardee's. I would give that probably. A 3.85. A 3.85. Okay. It's not bad. Again, I think it's overpriced. I'm giving it a 3.25. And our dog is barking in the background. I'm giving it a 3.25. This is... Again, it's not very big and it's overpriced. Uh -huh. I don't know what he's barking at. This is going to be bad the video. <laughs> I'm sorry for all the people <laughs> All right, so the cat is running in the house. Something's going down out on the back porch. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's uh, grade this last thing, which is the uh, bacon cheddar melt, which is also $3 of Hardy. So what would you give that on a zero to five scale? A 3.65. I'm giving this a two and a half. And here's why. Again, it's overpriced. It's dry. It's not bad, but to me that needs mustard and ketchup or something, doesn't it? A pickle, something? <laughs> a pickle. It's One dry. One solid pickle. I mean, it's just really dry. The meat's good, the bacon's good, but it's salty and it's dry. Anyway, Hardy's, not a bad effort, but I've had way better from our Hardee's, and I, I love their breakfast. I, I got their breakfast yesterday. Matter of fact, I've eaten Hardee's two days in a row. <laughs> but I got their breakfast yesterday, and it was outstanding. 
I got a Frisco breakfast sandwich. Their Frisco sandwich, breakfast sandwich mm -hmm. is the greatest thing ever. I'm going to link that down here at the bottom. That thing is outstanding. All right, honey, I'm going to have to have something to drink. I'm dry. That burger's <clears throat> dry. You agree? Uh-huh. Well, I'm kind of disappointed in you, Hardys, but you didn't do terrible, but I wanted all that to be better, didn't you? Yeah, boy. <laughs> All right, uh, Goofy Wit got like one of the boxes for six dollars or whatever, and he loved that thing. Maybe we should have done that. Maybe we'll do that next time. Or they're just spicy chicken sandwiches. This is great. He sandwich. claims their spicy chicken sandwich is great. Probably I, I just because I like chicken sandwiches so much. I don't think I've ever had it. One update to our one of our recent videos: <clears throat> the ghost pepper, along with those other hot sauces, have caused me a little intestinal distress. <laughs> And we're going to take a little break from some hot foods here for a while. I know I am. <laughs> or that hot. But that was a fun video to make, and we hope you watched it. And it was with our buddy, Michael. Little Mikey. All right, so let's, this video is getting long, but we wanted to put all the Hardy stuff together. Look, Hardy's is great. I just don't think these are the things you should get. This is my opinion. I think you should get number the number one combo with no onions and a Diet Coke to drink. Uh, I think you should say <laughs> All-Star Box. He always gets the All-Star Box, too. All right, so four. Huddy. And the Chili King. We're out, Toodles. Bye. Addy 5000. I haven't said that in a while. Bye-bye.